Health and well-being is very important and necessary for a long, happy, and healthy life. In our fast-paced society, we tend to overlook health and well-being due to how busy we are. Most of the time, we almost forget to check in with ourselves to see how we are doing mentally, physically, and emotionally. Along with that, there has been a rise in social media that promotes unrealistic lifestyles, physiques, and bad habits. This gives way for many mental and eating disorders such as anorexia, body dysmorphia, bulimia, and others. Another downside with social media is the rise in cyberbullying, strangers being able to hide behind a screen and anonymously tear people down. This causes the rate of mental health disorders to skyrocket. We have also seen the rate of suicide within 5 to 11 year olds become record-breaking high within young individuals. Here in the Fort Myer, Naples area, there is a greater number of schools. Our part in helping this issue is partnering with Girls on the Run at Lake Park Elementary. We are helping this community-based issue by starting young, teaching healthy habits, how to be confident, as well as making the girls feel heard by the coaches. Our goals are to help these young girls build confidence and love for themselves and others. We do this by helping them create a balance between psychological and physical skills. To build on physical skills, each lesson we have them run around the track or get them involved in some kind of running activity. Often we have the girls set a goal before they start and they collect a sticker after each lap to keep track. Doing this twice a week helps build their endurance and also helps them prepare for the 5k at the end of the season. Our group mentality also helps push every single girl to do their best. We often cheer for each other and run around the track together too. At the end of each lesson, we come back inside and discuss what we've learned. We talk about what may have been hard, easy, or ways to help others in that aspect. This also allows us to create connections between each other and to create a safe place to express our feelings. Our project objectives is to teach young girls life lessons and skills that they can take with them into later life as they grow and develop into young ladies. Through the program, we get to assist in leading the girls through mental and health exercises that allow them to be a better version of themselves in the future. The objective that we have chosen for our project is very personal to our group members, as we have all been in the position of the young girls that we are teaching, but lack the program's guidance. Although we had maternal guidance as we grew older, the connections that these young girls make with each other and the coaches allow them to grow and make positive connections within the program. Problem solving and critical thinking are techniques of civic engagement that the herd has been utilizing. After we went to the service learning fair, we met and collectively agreed to reach out and work with girls on the run, and we, the herd, were welcomed with open arms. We encountered bumps on the road, such as scheduling, but we were able to make a group chat with the other coaches discussing who will come on said days, creating the foundation of great communication between us and the other girls on the run coaches. As we continue working with Girls on the Run and moving along the active citizen continuum, we started off as students taking the foundation of civic engagement course. After going to the service learning fair, we became volunteers and we connected with the Girls on the Run and completed our online and in-person training. Moving along to conscientious citizens, we realized that because this generation is connected with social media at a young age, it is important that we are able to build these girls' confidence and help them to also uplift their peers around them. As we become active citizens and grow with these girls with this program, our service here will not end as we'll continue to help build and give back to the community, and we plan to continue working with the girls on the run on upcoming events. There are four main elements of civic engagement that everyone will experience when volunteering. The ones that connect to our group and community partner are serving, giving, and leading. Serving because we perform our coach duties and do everything in the best interest of our team. We give our time by coming to practice, running with the girls, giving lessons, and interacting with the girls. We lead by being role models for the girls in our team. By being women in STEM, we show the girls that anything is possible. Lastly, leading because we set an example for the girls in our team. They look up to us. can run and control our feelings. Running and the coaches. I love how we learn to like control our emotions to get hard. I like doing it because I like that it talks about girl power. I like running. I like that we get to learn and um, like control our feelings.
I love how we learn to be positive. My favorite part of being a Girls on the Run coach is watching them do their reflections at the end of the lesson and seeing their unique perspectives of what they want to take away from the lesson. Even though it has only been a couple weeks, we have seen so many improvements with the girls and we see them using their lessons in their day-to-day -day lives. My favorite part of being a Girls on the Run coach would be seeing the girls have realization or light bulb moments during lessons. It has made me realize how having a good support group can really push you outside your limits and give you the confidence to not be scared to take a chance. Being a coach has also made me realize that some of these problems that these little girls have, we also have as adults. Being a Girls on the Run coach has impacted me to reconnect with my inner child and to reevaluate my self-talk to be more positive, improve my confidence, as well as talk and work well with my peers. The thing that has impacted me the most about being a coach is watching the girls flourish with each lesson and actually finding confidence in myself that I didn't know I needed through the girls that I'm coaching.